the Olympic champion and the ducks. So how can an Olympic champion be associated with ducks? How? I'm going to tell you the real life story of the Olympic champion Bobby Pierce. Bobby Pierce was born in Sydney, Australia into a family of extraordinary sportsmen where his father, grandfather Henry John Pierce was an Australian champion in sculling. Even his father has taken part in the world championship twice. Sculling. Sculling is a sport where one man rows a small boat with two oars, one in each hand. Bobby, at the age of six, won his first race competing against 14 years old. By the time he was 20 years old, Bobby was the sculling champion of Australia. The following year, he went to Amsterdam to compete in the Olympic Games. So in the finals, he competed against Ken Myers of America. From the start of the race, Bobby was in the lead. At the halfway, he was still leading and much ahead of Myers. It seemed that Bobby could easily win. Then suddenly, something happened. Bobby had to stop in the middle of the race. Why? Why did he stop? So I have a small video for you all. Have a look. I'll be back in a few minutes. Here I come, two rivals locked in a wall of scarlet and gold. 1928 Olympics, and it's a war between the other rivals. Look, Pierce, Pierce is coming up, Pierce from Australia and Scotland, he's from France. So why did he stop? Yes, he stopped because he saw a duck and a brood of a ducklings swimming across the canal. The poor birds had no idea that they were in the middle of an Olympic race. So immediately, as you saw, Bobby slowed his boat down. The people on the shore were shouting as if they were mad. But Bobby waited patiently until all the ducklings were out of his way. Then he picked up the speed again and went to win the race easily. So of all the Olympic heroes, it was he who won everybody's heart. So from the age of six, Bobby had competed, competed in races. He did so for 33 years and retired from sports in 1945. During all this time, he never lost a single race. So I hope you all understood the story of the Olympic champion and the Ducks.